All right, hello everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back with the next episode of the Soldier series of Mass Effect. Before we get into the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications so you can be notified of all my videos that are posted. Anyway, let's get down to it. Um, need to announce something though first a couple things actually first thing is i have a new mic um this is uh um live v8 sound card microphone it, it's a microphone with a sound card it's the v8 sound card um i played i got it off amazon it was pretty cheap i'd actually gotten it a couple years ago but i was just too scared of setting it up but it was actually really easy to set up. So, um, as you can tell, it sounds a lot better than the old mic I was using. The old mic I was using was, um, was a Fifeen, which it wasn't a bad mic. It just, for some reason, there was echo. And so this one, you can actually turn the echo all the way down on the sound card, which is nice. So there's that. And also... I tried recording an episode earlier this week and it didn't go well. So you're going to miss a little bit of the adventure, which is unfortunate, but really there's nothing I can do about it. So there's a deposit here. I cannot get to it. There's just no way you can get to it. Um, unless you go like all the way around, I would think. I don't know. I mean, let me let me look at the map. Okay. Yeah, my guess is you go all the way around to get it, but I'm not going to do that. I'm Fuck that, I'm not going to do it. Um, this is part of the reason why I couldn't get the episode recorded properly. It's because that little fucking cobalt deposit was driving me nuts, and it just pissed me off so much that I couldn't get to it. So, let me look at the map to see what I'm driving on here, I mean. Like, I'm sorry, there needs to be paths, there needs to be something to get to these things. There, it, it doesn't need to be this random fucking terrain anymore. It needs to be, this is how you get to it. So, okay, I luckily got to the fucking deposit. This is why I don't like playing these new games. I don't like it because back in the old days, back when graphics weren't such a big deal, you could actually play the fucking game. You know, it's not like now where, um, it's not like now where, um, you know, the graphics are the big deal and then the story and the playability takes a back seat. You know, Mass Effect 3 has a huge problem. Um, you get the apartment through the DLC and you have the option to change your decorations, which is cool. There's where I'm supposed to go. Um, but it's cool you can change those decorations and stuff, but it doesn't work because when you do it, it'll work for the first time, but then when you leave and come back, your decorations aren't there. And you can change them back and change them back and change them back, and they won't change back. It is a flaw, and Bioware just doesn't care. They won't fix it. It would be an easy fucking patch. Don't give me this bullshit that they couldn't patch it. They totally could. They just don't want to do it. Because they don't care. It's why I don't really trust a lot of people in this world either, you know? 
It's because of stupid shit like this. You know, it's a count on one hand list of all the people I trust and associate with. I'm sorry, but it's just to that point where people just have it out for me anymore here in the United States. You know, there's somebody I do talk to every day and she's really cool. It's and I do trust her, but she's the only one I trust. I do not trust anybody else. Why do I want everything for experience? Rescuers? Oh, thank God. See? I told you somebody would come to investigate that signal. My name is Dr. Ross, Chief Exogeny Researcher at this facility. We've been trapped in this room for days. We're almost out of food and water. You got here just in time. I need to know what's going on. Why is this place crawling with Thorian creepers? How do you know about the Thorian? I know what Exogeny was up to. I saw what they let the Thorian do to those colonists, so I destroyed it. Our secret's out then. No point in my lying. You already know the worst. The creepers here were created using altered samples from the specimens on Pharos. We discovered a way to turn them into docile, obedient servants. Everything was going fine until a few days ago. Then all the creepers suddenly went berserk. Only a handful of us made it back into the safety of this room. What did you expect? You couldn't really believe those things were safe. We knew there were risks, but I thought we'd taken all the necessary precautions. I didn't mean for this to happen. Look, I know what we did here was wrong. I'll admit that. But it's over now. There's no sense reporting this to the authorities, right? You were in charge of this project. The safety of the staff was your responsibility. They trusted you, and you betrayed that trust. Be reasonable. I didn't mean for this to happen. Besides, how does it help anyone if I end up in jail? Normally, Exogeny would have my back, but it sounds like they're going to have their hands full cleaning up the mess on Pharaoh's. But I've got money. A nice little emergency fund I set up. It's yours if you let us go. Okay, give me a sec here. All right. All right, that looks better. That, that feels better. Okay, I had to readjust the mic. I'm sorry, everyone. The victims here deserve justice. 
I have to take you in. Uh, that's not going to happen. Open fire. Open fire! Two with one shot. Look at that. There we go. That feels so much better. I I apologize, everyone. I needed to readjust the mic. There we go. There. Now I can see a lot better. I can... Okay. Like I said, this new mic, um, it has a, um, it has a, um, sound card with sound effects on it, but I, I don't think I'm going to use the sound effects because they just don't work right. Sometimes they'll work fine, but then there's other times where you'll barely hear the sound effect and I don't know what it is. I don't know if. I, I don't think it's a connectivity issue because I've got it. I've got the uh, mic and sound card set up to the um, plugged into the computer directly. Come on, get up there. Like, I could understand if it was a connectivity issue if I had it plugged into my um, USB hub. Because, I mean, that thing gets fucking busy. But, like I said, I have it connected directly to the PC, so... And there's where that thing is. Great. Finally. Fucking A. I don't know why it drives me nuts if I can't get everything. Now we can get out of here. But I do like this microphone. It has a power button. You have to turn the sound card on and off. You have to turn it on to use the mic. You have to turn it off when you're done with it. It's so it's so nice. It's so nice. Okay, so this besieged base, um, you get a call from Admiral Hackett saying, oh, there's these researchers that were taken captive and we need you to go in and rescue them, but they're doped up on some drug so they don't know what's going on. They might walk into your, <laughs> walk into your firefight, so... Okay. And the only reason I'm doing the extra stuff is for experience more than anything.
Okay. Oh, there's a warning over here. Is that where we're going? Yeah. Okay. And that's what we were looking well that was one thing we were looking for. We want to take down the transmitter. That was what it was. Another matriarch writing. What about you? There we go, more writings. Um. Okay, so what are we gonna find next? I wonder Okay, so the next one Actually, we might not do Vermeer we might do um asteroid x57 Just so we can have it done Got them all in one shot. Look at that.
Okay. Do they need exoskeletons? Let's find out. You don't. What about you? You don't. Okay. Okay, so now we get to fight a Thresher Maw. I do like with this mod I have on this game, it shows you where everything is on the map. There he is. Huh. Maybe I was close enough he couldn't move. I don't know. I ain't complaining, because that was the easiest Thresher Maul I've ever had to kill. <laughs> it was either a glitch or I was close enough where he couldn't move. Okay. So we do need to change my gun. We're going to go pistol. And what I'm going to do is get them over here. Get over there. Get over there. You stay in there. Go, go, go. Won't get me next time. I will destroy you. There we go. You want to go slowly in this. I will destroy you. Got your ass. And that's all the targets. And we didn't hit a we didn't hit a single scientist. Sweet. Or I thought that was all the Go, go, go. Ah. There we go. We got them all. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. We got them all without killing a single scientist. I've never done that before. I've never done that before. Is 
that's why I kept my squad back. I didn't want them um, coming in and shooting somebody by accident. Because that's what happened at Pharos. They shot a couple of the colonists by accident. What do you have on for your exoskeleton? Huh. There we go. Cool. So I'm actually proud of myself able to kill all the extremists without having to kill a single scientist. That I've never done that. I've always killed at least one by accident. Okay, we can get back to Normandy. And then, like I said, I think we're going to do Asteroid X-57, just to switch things up. Message coming in. Patching it through. I didn't think it could be done, Commander. You managed to secure the base and neutralize the biotics without a single civilian casualty. Just doing my job, Admiral. I couldn't let innocent lives be lost. I wish every soldier had your definition of just doing your job. You're a credit to the uniform, Shepard. We're in your debt. Fifth fleet out. Okay. So asteroid X-57 is where we're going next. There's nothing to scan here. It's just, um, we're just going to the asteroid. Oh, guy. Guy. So what's this over here? Is this the survey station? I think it is. It is. Ooh, 
a logic arrest tool. Callie needs that. No, she doesn't. She's got a savant. You can have it though, Miss Um Liara. Now we need to go to the transmission tower. Well, actually, no. We'll go this way first. There's an anomaly this way. We'll go this way first. At least you're not timed on this. You know, I, I'm surprised they don't give you a timer. There we go. Shit. Yeah, see, I didn't know this was up here. A Nexus Omni Tool. Doesn't do shit, though. Okay. Now we'll go to the transition transmission tower. Okay, and here's the transmission tower, which I think tells you where everything is. There we go. Yep, it tells you where the survey stations are. We were at three. I know that. So it's just one and two. Headed in the right direction. I don't know who you are, but I'm damn it. Again, why am I killing all the turrets and stuff? One, so I don't get killed, and two, so, um...
so I can get the experience. Boom, there we go. Here it comes. Boom, right in the head. All right, cool. Get me some grenades, open up a locker. And there's nothing up here except for in the room. Okay. Hey. Hey, it's for horses. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Are you hurt? Takes more than that one shot to bring me down. Sorry. I didn't even realize you were human until... Well, I guess I'm not much of a soldier. I know you're scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard, with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Adwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. There are four million people down there, Shepard. I... My family. They live in Aronis. My kids and grandkids. Nice community, good schools. Batarians everywhere and I need to shut down all three torches. Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. You set them up. Can you disable them? Not from here. No. There are manual controls by the entrance to the torch facility inside the blast zone. You can disarm the caps there. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. These Batarians are ruthless. 
I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen, I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. I'll look for them, but the torches have to be my priority. Yeah, you're right. Saving Terra Nova is more important than my team. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That or being held hostage by the Batarians. A woman named Kate Bowman contacted me. The Batarians haven't found her yet. Katie's alive. She's one of my best engineers. She signed on with her brother, Aaron, I, I think his name is. He's part of the security detail. I hope they're okay. Well, you'd better find a good place to hide. If the Batarians come back and find you. Yeah. I think I'll make myself scarce. Good luck, Shepard. Okay. So we got the first fusion torch shut down. Now we're going to go to the anomaly, which I believe is something to bypass. Nope, it's a survey station. Oh no, it's the radio station. Okay. Here's the survey station. now we'll get that do the body Okay. Now, we're going to go to Fusion Torch number two. You don't have to find the three missing engineers. I just do it because you get extra um, experience. Now, we need to kill the turrets here. That way then we can concentrate on the minefield. And we leveled up. Nice. All right. Um, 
fitness for you. Singularity for you. Damping for you. There we go. Oh, and then, yep, okay. So we want to park the Mako. Right around here. There we go. There. Okay. Knew there were two more of them. Boom. Hey, okay, first thing you want to do is disarm these blasting caps. There we go. Now you go in the building. Now when you walk out, you don't have to worry about them. Got you. Got you. Got you. All right. Cool. Area secured. Okay. 
<laughs> I'm pretty good with this sniper rifle. Okay. So now, once we get back outside, we'll figure out where we're going. There's an anomaly over here. Being we shut down the blasting caps, we don't have to worry about them now. For some reason, though, if you bring the Mako in here, even with the blasting caps disabled, they'll still blow up. Which I don't understand why you'd think, oh, they're disabled, they, they're harmless, right? No. No, that's not how it works. Oh. Okay, I didn't know this was over here either. That's why I like this mod. They show where everything is. Okay. Explosive cash. We want to check that out. Because, like I said, I've never done this before, so. it is. I thought it was up. No, it's down. There.
It's just grenades! Huh! I'll be damned! It was just grenades! You'd think there'd have been something cool there, but no! No, man! That sucks! Come on! They could have put something cool there. They just didn't. You know? Now there's the main facility that um, exclamation point, but we don't want to go there yet. We want to go to the other tor torch because you have to shut down all three torches to get into the main facility and you'll see why in a minute. Okay, so now that we got the turrets out of the way, now we can come in here, kill some more Batarians, and shut down the torch. There's a third one, I think. Yep. <laughs> Boom. Okay, what do I have for my grenade? I don't want to see. Okay, yeah. All clear. I'm getting pretty decent with the grenades, too. <laughs> I used to shit on the grenades, but now I'm getting pretty good with them. There we go. There we go. Force three shut down. Hold 
right there. This doesn't have to end in bloodshed. Don't come any closer. We can do this the hard way, or we can end this peacefully. I didn't think you Batarians knew the meaning of the word. Look, I'm just doing my job here. Hijacking this rock wasn't my idea. I signed on to make a little profit. A quick slave grab, nothing more. This isn't just a slave grab anymore. Millions of people are gonna die. Don't you think I know that? I'm just following orders here. If it were up to me, we'd have already left. Well, it's not too late. You can still leave. I don't think so. Bollock would skin me alive and sell my hide out of spite. Crazy bastard. This whole mission's gone to hell and I'm gonna pay for it. So why do you listen to him? Good question. I had a bad feeling about this from the moment we landed. Now Balak wants you dead. And what Balak wants, Balak gets. I can't change that. Do you always want to be second in command? Get me out of here and I'll take care of Balak. Then you can start giving the orders. Huh. An interesting proposal. It certainly has benefits over the current situation. Shut it down. This is Balak's problem now. I hope you're as quick with a gun as you are with your promises, for both our sakes. Balak will get what's coming to him, and so will you if I ever catch you in human territory again. Are we clear? Right? Perfectly. Balak's holed up in the main facility. You'll need this to get in. Don't underestimate him. He's a mean bastard. Let's go. We're getting off this rock. Okay. I didn't go in here. I totally forgot about going in here. Which... Just a locker. Yeah, I, I know my next character will be an infiltrator because I'm, I'm having so much fun with the sniper rifle. Hell yeah, man. Okay, where are we going next? Survey Station 2, that's where we're going. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's where we're going. Survey Station 2, and I know what this one is, okay. A Titan for Turian. That's not bad. Okay. There we got one. leading off to the east which would be towards the um towards the main facility but you want to stay on this edge here because this is where you're supposed to go to find that other body which is right here For a prodigy biotic amp. Okay.
There's one. There's two. There's three. Okay. Okay, you're gone out. You're going to need it. Oops. I'm so used to reloading. Manually. That's okay. Boom. Hey, you know what we're gonna do? There you go, Tally. Boom. Uh, he's not dead? He should have been. Bastards. There we go. You ran off to the council hoping for help. When you didn't get it, you hid. You've got no one to blame but yourselves. Right? Enough! You couldn't possibly understand. Actually, you just don't want to understand. And I'm done wasting my breath. Now, if you want your friends to live, I suggest you step aside. You can go. But this isn't over. I'll find you eventually. Maybe. But I made sure you won't follow me today. Those charges are still on timer. Better hurry if you want 
to save your friends. Okay. It's up there, okay. Here's one of them. There we go. Okay, you got way more than enough time to do this. Area it must be either down or something. It's been a while since I've done this, so... Usually I just attack Balak, but... Since we're going on the peaceful path, um... Where? There. I can't get to him. It must be up. There we go. There it is. Yep. Okay. He left. Is that is that all right? Letting him go was better than the alternative. I thought you were going to stay someplace safe. I there might have been something I could have done to help. I thought I should be here. I know this asteroid better than anyone. But you did it. Another hour and our course would have been irreversible. I ran the numbers, Shepard. X-57 would have struck near the capital city. The most densely populated region. But that's not going to happen, thanks to you. Is Katie in here? Is she alright? Is her team? Balak was holding them hostage. I let him go to save them. Let a terrorist go or sacrifice innocent lives. I'm glad that's not a choice I had to make. Is that... Will you get in trouble for that? I mean, he could do the same thing somewhere else, couldn't he? The Alliance has a whole navy full of people like me, waiting to take him down. We'll be watching. Shepard, thank you for my grandchildren's lives. I don't think I'll stick around, though. Not with the team gone. Too many ghosts. It's time for me to get back and spend some time with my family. Before I go, I'd like to offer you something. Maybe you'll have more use for it than I will. As lead engineer, I get some quality items. Take your pick. You've earned it. We'll take the heavy armor. I need that heavy armor. I hope you get good use out of it. One more thing. You asked me to look into your missing engineers. Have you found them? Yes, all of them. Their bodies, anyway. Oh, I, I see. Well then, I guess it's better than not knowing. Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. We owe you. So we got the Colossus IX. Nice. We got IX out of that. Sweet. Yoink. Hell yeah, bro. The best armor in the game for Shepard. Sweet. Now we gotta let the engineers out. I can't believe you let Ballot go to save us. I half expected you to just let us die, sacrifice the few for the many. 
then I'd be no better than the Batarians. Besides, Balak won't get away with this. I know who he is now. He can't run forever. <laughs> you sound like my brother. He was always so stubborn, but always willing to do the right thing, no matter what. Your brother was the one Balak killed? Yes. Aaron, he was the one who convinced me to join the team here. Said it would be an adventure. I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but I should see to Aaron. I understand. You've been through enough today. I'll get out of your way. Thank you. Oh, I don't even know your name. Shepard. Commander Shepard. Thank you, Commander Shepard. You're not exactly what I expected, but thank you. I'll get out of your way. So long, Kate. I appreciate that, Commander. Goodbye. Okay. So now, that's the whole reason you come to Asteroid X-57. It's so you can um, get the good armor or the good Omni tool. But we already got the Omni tool for Tally, and we already got her armor too. So that's why I was able to pick the um, heavy armor. Let's get out of here. And I think I'm going to call it for this video because I'm starting to get hungry. So... All right, we'll just go to the Normandy, get the save, and then I'll call it for this video. I do need to make a selfie, and I keep forgetting to make selfie. I should have made one here. That's okay. I'll take one with Joker. Let's see if I can take one with Joker. Yeah, why not? <laughs> that kind of looks cool. Okay. All right. So that'll be the end of this video. So I hope you all had fun. And I'll see you all in the next episode.